Hi, Jill Jackson in the studio today to pour some colorful angel wings. My video number 427. My recipe for paint is one third acrylics and two thirds Floetrol. I started out my pour cup with about four ounces of white paint. And now I'll start adding my colors one by one. I cannot for the life of me remember where I saw this, but one of the many videos I watched, I saw an angel wing pour where they went ahead and poured the paint in over a popsicle stick, so I thought I'd give it a try. I believe the idea is to stop the colors from going so deeply into the white paint. So I'll go on layering my colors, and I'm going to need about 16 ounces of paint to pour angel wings on a 16 by 20 canvas. I'm elevating one side of the canvas with a stack of cups. The idea is to basically pick a spot in the middle and pour slowly until you're just about out of paint. I got off to a couple of false starts here, but no worries, I'll find my way. And there we go, I've added a little bit more elevation with my hand. And I will pour this down, it's looking pretty good. And I used my hand to try and catch those last few drips from the cup. Now I've removed my cups. I'm going to go ahead and start tilting this back a little bit and then very, very slowly down towards the end, trying to keep that canvas pretty straight. Woohoo! I've got some wings! I'll just do a few little touch ups here and there. and use the rest of my paint to pour around as a border. You'll notice I pour the border a little bit far away from the wings to let the paint go ahead and reach the edge by itself. A quick torch and we are set to dry. Or are we? Even though I checked, my canvas was not quite level, so I had a little bit of stretching to do, and I'm going to cross my fingers and go for this tilt. Slowly, slowly, I really don't want to lose this beautiful shape. This is painful. I know how this usually works out for me. Okay, I've just hit that edge. Can I get the middle to go back? I believe I have. Yes! I can't believe I got a second chance with these wings. I allowed the canvas to dry completely and sealed with some clear spray gloss. I just love the way these wings came out. I'd love to hear what you think in the comments. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe for more tips and ideas and visit sisterearth.net for videos, events, and to check out the fine art and children's books available for purchase. As always, happy creating, my friends!